Uh, this is a quick video um, called Celebration Friday, which I'm going to be trying to do um, more often. I'm going to be trying to get out of my own way in terms of actually, you know, posting and, and doing blog posts and so on. I have a big thing to celebrate this Friday. This is something that's going to be for the ref for you like normal people. This is going to seem so silly. But um for me with the Lyme disease, those of you who are mums, um, you'll know what they call mummy brain is like. Um, those of you with fibromyalgia will know what how much worse fibro fog is. Well, what Lyme disease has done to my cognitive abilities was um i have to say pain and stuff like that i can cope with but my ego was massively dented by the just like my brain just not working and i was terribly frustrated so a little while ago i really started working on this and today i had a big sign of the fact that i felt that i was making a really really big improvement wait for it because for me this is huge okay today i managed to make it all the way to my naturopath from St Albans to Kings Langley and then all the way from her to work in Radlett to my salon Espiritu with no sat nav no sat nav this is crazy I have been driving to her for I mean it must be a year year and a half or so um the loveliest naturopath ever if you if any of you want a recommendation Dawn Golton is just fabulous um, I have not been able to do it without the sat nav. I couldn't remember. I would get confused. I would get lost. It was an absolute nightmare. Today I did the whole thing. This is huge for me. Um, I'm, I will put this in a proper blog post maybe and write it up on Monday. But I'm going to give you the five things that have helped me. So if any of you are struggling with fibro fog or premenopausal things or, you know, even some of these tips might help people with some problems with Alzheimer's although I know that's much more serious but um, I've always taken supplements I've always taken omega-3 6 and 9 those um, make a, a big big difference to fibro fog and um, mummy brain you know typical mummy brain the far infrared you'll see my reviews about far infrared on my blog far infrared gets oxygen going in your body and and like you need oxygen for your brain to work otherwise it just it just doesn't work um, but re and then I've been doing, because I, I wanted some, I think, negative thinking about I'm not able to do this, I'm rubbish at this, I used to be able to do it, blah, blah, blah. That does not help. So over the last six months, I have done loads of positive thinking, positive affirmations, EFT, emotional freedom technique. I'll describe in my blog what that is. I've done lots of this to make sure that I actually got out of my own way. Do you know what I mean? So I didn't let myself get in my own way of, of my issues. But then also, secretly, I've been going to tap classes. Um, now, it's this, I, I was talking to somebody really, really clever the other day who went, yes, yes, that's because it affects the blah, 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 bit of the brain that, um, yeah, I can't remember what he said. But anyway, so it's the, it's the timing and the sound of the tippity tapping basically, that I think is really helping um, improve the brain. And the other thing I've been doing, which I've also been quite quiet about, is... Um, we got a piano for my daughter in February, um, who of course is just making large, loud, plinky plonky noises on it still. Um, but I've been gradually playing the piano. I used to play the piano as a little girl. I had forgotten everything. I'd forgotten the names of the notes, where they were, what they were, how it all worked, the names of everything. I couldn't read anything. Um, I couldn't remember things that I used to do, nothing like that. So I got myself a piano. I reminded myself of things. I started right from the beginning. Oh, hi, Rachel. Nice to see you. As this is Celebration Friday, and I was just saying, if you look back, you'll see what I'm celebrating. I'm convinced that playing the piano and doing tap dancing is helping me to reconnect the synapses that have gone wrong in my head, basically. Um, because, of course, playing um, is, I think, combining the left and right brain so um hey Rachel so yes so this is my celebration Friday I got all the way to Kings Langley 
and then from there to braddle it with no sat nav this is massive to those of you who haven't had a problem ever with cognitive problems you may not appreciate but for me it was wonderful and I also had just the loveliest day I had a friend surprise me for a cup of coffee and um, yes just had the loveliest day I hope you all have a really lovely weekend I'm looking forward to seeing my kids sing at the school fair and dance and larks in the parks and sitting on picnic blankets and um, I wish you all a wonderful weekend filled with picnic blankets, ice creams and cake and maybe not too much cake, maybe a glass of wine um, and friends. Take care, bye!